That a little league glove, it fit a little snug, it wouldn't even close. Because we met in uh, Denton, Texas, um, at the University of North Texas. We were, we were, we were all friends before we started the band. Here we are, a couple years later. We had that that friendship before we even started doing all this, and so uh, I think that's everybody asks, you know, what's the key to doing it this long? And I think you know we started as friends first. Every step, we really did it the old-fashioned way. It's, it's from the ground up, how do we get a gig? How do we get someone, some station, somewhere playing our music? Um, all right, we've got a couple trucks. We can put everything in the flatbed of our truck. We need... How to run a PA. We need a PA. So we, you know, it was like playing enough shows to buy our own PA. And then everything felt really great, and we were just doing really well regionally. And then it was like reinventing ourselves when we signed a record deal and tried to take, take it nationally. You know, it feels like every step along the way, um, there's challenges. And we've got to do it, you know, the old fashioned way, which I, makes it that much more satisfying. Then you break it in. That pickup truck that my dad picked up had a clutch, man, it took me all summer. My first truck was a Ford Ranger. Um, a hand me down from uh, my dad that he was using it as a, a truck out on the hunting lease and um, I learned how to drive a manual transmission on that that truck. I kind of wish I still had it today. I, I, I think I ended up tra trading it in for uh, our first van I believe which was a Ford Econoly. What's next for us we've always been kind of a touring band. Uh, all we know how to do is make new songs and go out and tour <laughs> and so that's and that's what we love to do and so uh, yeah, I feel like, you know, we had success recently here with our last single, uh, Love Ain't, and then that kind of re-energized our careers and that stuff, and, and I feel like with Break It In, we're kind of riding that wave, and it's an exciting place to be. We kind of feel like we have, almost in a way, like a second chance, and, and, and it's a great time to do it, and, you know, we just plan on putting out more good music and, and uh, being on the road and, and having fun. So